I'd like you to write, I'd like you to write about a book that you have read in English. And there are five choices for what exactly you're going to write. Um, one of them is a letter. Uh, next choice is a gift. The next choice is a news story. The next choice is the prequel. And the next choice is an alternative ending. So I'd like you to choose one of these. I'll just give you some more information. Um, if you're going to write a letter, then I would like you to imagine that you are one of the characters in the book and write a letter or an email to somebody, probably somebody else in the book. Um, or another alternative for a letter is that um, you are you and write a letter to somebody in the book about something. Um, next choice is a gift. Uh, so you want to give a gift to someone in the book. You want to get a gift for someone in the book. Um, what would you get? What gift would you get? Um, and why would the gift help them? Um, what could they do with the gift when they get it? Uh, that's the uh, second choice. Um, next choice then is a news story. And I'd like you to imagine that you are a journalist um, in the book, in the story or in the world of the story, and you work for a newspaper or a TV news station, and I'd like you to write about something in the story, um, probably something that happens, some kind of event. Um, and when you're writing a news story, I'm sure you've read a newspaper before or seen a TV news, um, there's usually a headline. So this is the headline, this is what the story is. And then the news story also tells us who, what, where, when, why and how. So the news story will answer these questions. Um, and not just uh, somebody had breakfast somewhere is not really news. Think about news. What would be news? Um, next, then, is the prequel. Now, a prequel is a story before the story. Um, so think about this story and I'd like you to think about what happened before the beginning of this story. Uh, please write an episode or write a story from before the story happened. Um, how did they get to the beginning of the story? Uh, next then, your final choice is an alternative ending. So please change the ending of the book. Uh, pick a point in the story, somewhere in the story, and then write a different ending change the events, change the story. And so those are your five choices. Um, when you're writing, I'd like you to use your imagination. And don't worry if the details are not correct. You don't have to go back to the book and read it again. You don't have to check details. Just use your imagination. Think about the story. Think about what you felt from the story and right from there. Um, also, I please don't, um, no spoilers. So don't tell us the ending of the story. Don't give us any important um, plot changes or plot twists. Um, and um, please also write a lot, try and write a lot. So don't worry about mistakes. I'm not, I'm not, this is not a grammar test. Uh, this is a test of your imagination. Um, and so then next then think about um, which book are you going to write about um, so choose one of the books you have read in English uh, choose one of the characters in the book um, you may be writing a letter you may be imagining you are that character you may be writing about a character uh, choose one of the events in the book and uh, choose a point in the story and when you've chosen which book, again, you need to choose one of these. So you're going to write a letter or you're going to write about a gift um, or you're going to write a new story or you're going to write the prequel. What happened before the story um, or you're going to write an alternative ending. 
So you need to choose one of these. Um, just again, a reminder, please use your imagination. Um, don't use the book. You don't need to read the book again. You shouldn't need to look at the book again. Um, don't worry about the details in the book. If you can't remember, just make it up. And uh, no spoilers, please. And please write a lot. Um, just to help you get started, uh, if you're writing a letter, uh, that's the way to start a letter, dear Huck. Um, if you're talking about a gift, um, I would give Huck a tent because uh, that's a newspaper headline, um, Boy Lost in Mississippi. Once upon a time, if you're writing a story, after they reach the island, if you want to change the story, find a point in the story when to change it. Um, so... Uh, those are your five choices, and please um, start writing. <laughs>